What's up y'all i'm back with another video this time i'm gonna be showing y'all how i created this mullet cut wig i used the 4x4 closure i cut it in half and then i cut the band from around the perimeter of it i glued it to the side of the closure so i could create like some lace lines which you guys will see that it'll look like the little razor lines on the side i use one pack of empire 12 inch and then one pack of janet collection i'm gonna use the seams on the wig cap as a guide um, as you see on both sides of the seam, that's where I glued the Janet Collection um, 27 piece. And then on the inner half of it, that V section, that's where I'm going to glue in the um, pack of 12 inch. Honestly, I should have used about a pack and a half to two packs. Um, this was my first time doing this look, so I didn't know like how many packs would be required, which won't end up being good, but I like my hair kind of full. So honestly, if I ever make this wig again, I'm going to go in for a fuller look. I used the closure that came with the 27 piece and I sewed that to the top. That created a little extra volume. I tried the wig on, it fits perfectly. And as you see right now, I'm just shaving down some of the sides, doing away with that excess hair to make it lay a little bit flatter. And I moved on to the bang. I'm just gonna razor it a little bit, pixie out the ends, and then just kind of do a little slight bump going to the side, just so it's kind of swept over a little bit versus coming straight down over the eyes. Next, I razored the wig some, and then I'm gonna go through and add some messy curls, run my hands through them, just to kind of create some waves. And I'm gonna use a trimmer. I shaved down the side just a little bit, dried that mold, and then once I put it back on, you see that I go in with the um, trimmer again and make more defined lines. And then just to make them look a little more sharp, you see that I use some makeup just to kind of go through the lines. And this wig will be available on the site. Although this wig is mine, I'm gonna have a duplicate. Thank y'all for watching, I'll see you in the next video.